Hello, I'm Michelle Whiting, uh, one of the assessors here at the OCA, and I'd like to discuss the work of Adrian Eaton. So firstly, I'd like to have a look at the painting of a carbon fibre plant. He uses various techniques to score, to, to drag, um, and to make some quite intricate mark making where he's scoring into the into the surface overall what happens is he he ends up with a very effective uh, landscape which has a, a deep rich brown palette when i was looking at the work i was actually commending it and thinking well this is a really good place that he's got to and then surprisingly in his last section he turned his attention to some worldly matters where he was taking some of his experiences of the things that he was seeing and thinking about how he could communicate them um, through the medium of paint. They're, they're quite in your face. Um, not everybody's cup of tea, maybe. But having said that, uh, they stand out. They begin to ask us as a viewer questions. What's happening here? Why are these women half undressed? What's it about? Why have they got large heads? Why are their bodies shrinking into the background almost? The images come from very real problems um, that have been documented about the internet and internet safety um, with young people. Uh, looking at these young women it would appear that they potentially could be putting themselves into dangerous situations. Looking back at his research, what he's done is that he's started to think about the image of the selfie. What happens when we take a selfie with a phone? He's actually decoded certain things that are happening. The pout that teenage girls use when they're taking a selfie. One thing that he has got as well is the glaze of the eye. They're very particularly painted and very particularly drawn. What is interesting is that he's taken, and this is where I think there's something forceful about his painting technique, is that he's brought his techniques from his landscape into these highly politicised works. Uh, and I think that's to be commended. So when we look at the hair, he's scored and scratched into the hair in the same way as he would do if he was attending the landscape. He's using very particular colours and working his way through the colours in a very blocky way, which I think, again, kind of resonates with the idea of the selfie. These images are taken very close up. They force the perspective to alter. They force colours to become more intense in some, in some ways. And I think he's been very successful. Um, so there's, a, there's ways forward that I think that he can move with the work in the future. But for now, I'd just like to say congratulations on a very good body of work.